people have been killed after a three-story building collapsed in Bhivandi in Maharashtra. Rescue operations are underway as many others are still feared trapped under the debris. Maharashtra CM Eknath Shinde visited the tragedy site late last night and he also met the injured at the hospital in Bhivandi. On that note, my colleague Abhishek is with us on the phone line. Abhishek and ex Gracia had been announced. And what are the details that we are tracking at this point in time? What are the latest developments? For a fact, we know that CM Eknath Shinde had visited the injured late last night. It's definitely has been more than uh, 19 hours that the rescue operation still continues. And what we believe uh, at the given point of time is more than six to eight people are still trapped inside and around uh, more than uh, 14 to 15 have been rescued safely and three loss of life has been uh, reported till now and the rescue operation continues a uh, rescue operation in accordance with the uh, uh, ndrf tdrf uh, mumbai uh, thane fire brigade mumbai fire brigade mumbai police officials over there and with the help of locals also the rescue operation still continues and it's a very tragic incident. Late night, Chief Minister Ekna Shinde also visited the spot as well as he went to meet the injured in the nearby hospital that they were shifted and he has given clear instruction to speed up the rescue operation to save as much as life possible from there and give best treatment to the injured. And also five lakhs of compensation to the chain of disease has been also announced. Definitely, uh, whether the structural audit of this warehouse was done or not, and there are many other legalities into this that will uh, be inquired or ordered into later. But primary focus of the government still remains that, you know, those trapped inside should be uh, removed from the debris as soon as possible so that they get their best, better treatment and lives can be saved. Till now, three, uh, three lives have been lost and uh, more than 14 to 15 have been rescued. And eight, six to eight are believed to be trapped uh, inside the debris and we are continuously monitoring the situation since 18 hours to 19 hours and the operation of uh, the rescue operation still continues.